Hello everyone, this is Mark with MrHurricaneTracker.com. We've got a lot to talk about today, including the United States of America and uh, the severe weather that's happening. However, I would like to first get to our topic, which is our tropical weather. In fact, right now the Storm 92L has dissipated and is right now no longer a threat. It's down to a 30% chance that the storm will be still possible to increase to a tropical cyclone. About Right now it's about 1,100 uh, miles east of the Lesser Antilles and become very limited through to uh, develop in this, in this uh, region right now. And a lot has to do with the <clears throat> wind shear effect. Wind shear effect is affecting the storm system from accumulating. However, we got another two things uh, that we need to talk about. Two additional storms that are right here forming in the eastern Pacific, which has no limitations to forming because of the wind shear. In fact, the wind shear may not even affect these storms. However, they're so close to land, they may not develop. So let's take a quick look at these storms with Google Earth. As you see, there's some storms right here that uh, we just looked at. They are forming about more than 30% chance at this time. So we're going to continue to watch these storms as they do form. Right now, uh, the one of the storms did move on into the Gulf of Mexico. So that's a very deep concern that I have right now. Uh, one of those storms are going to uh, actually affect the Gulf of Mexico area. So we're going to continue to watch that as you see deep thunderstorms are developing within that region in the Gulf of Mexico. And it is a little bit far away from land. So we're going to continue to watch that as that could become a very severe storm system or even tropical uh, storm or depression. So we're going to continue to watch that. And then as we go off to the South African coast, we see the Storm 92L has been dissipated for the past 48 hours. And right now there are still some waves coming off of the South African coast, which is not that much to worry about at this time. And again, as we go back into the United States of America, right now you see that there is quite a bit of severe weather uh, possibilities. As you see the outline areas in orange, green, and pink, and yellow. The most active right now is in the pink and yellow, where you see severe thunderstorm warnings and others. Now this is around the Missouri area and pretty close to Indianapolis. So we're going to continue to watch all this weather in the next 24 to 40 hours, especially this storm system right here in the Gulf of Mexico. We're going to continue to watch that as it develops and this storm system as well right here in the eastern Pacific. Even though there's not much development going on with the 92L, we're going to continue to watch it just to make sure it doesn't change its mind and decide to accumulate and start building up again. Once again, we'll continue to watch these storms as they come off the South, Amer South African coast and make sure we continue to keep a good watch on it. So once again, please stay tuned to Mr. Hurricane Tracker for all the latest news and updates and also MrHurricaneTracker.com for the most recent information on these uh, updating uh, news events. Again, we thank you for watching. Please rate, subscribe, and comment and visit the YouTube channel by clicking the video. Thank you and have a great day.